I'm both board certified in pharmacotherapy and pediatrics, and I work in a hospital in an inpatient setting, and I take care of children anywhere from one hour of life until 18 years of age. I took the first pharmacotherapy exam in the third year it was offered because I thought it was important for our profession that we demonstrate excellence in our practice areas. Well, in the inpatient pediatric setting, depending on the age of your patient, you could do something quite different. In the neonatal setting, you probably spend more of your time making sure that there's the right dose for that very small gestational age patient. And if you have any counseling to do, it's going to be to the parent who may be taking home a baby for the first time, critically ill, who's going home on seven or eight medications, which is not the healthy baby they were expecting to take home. Versus older teenagers, you may be not only counseling the parents, but the teenager because they need to take responsibility for their own health care. Well, as a member of the healthcare team, my main role is to look at their medication therapy management to make sure not only that what they're on in the inpatient side matches their home medication regimen when it's appropriate. There are times that we hold their home medications because that may be why they've been admitted to the hospital, but not only looking at cultures and sensitivities to make sure they're on the right antibiotic, to make sure if the patient's in renal failure that I have fluid restricted their antibiotics or other medications into the least amount of fluid. So we work as a team as we round on each patient to make sure that we're doing the most appropriate thing for that patient to make sure we get them better the quickest we can and to get them home. I think being board certified as a healthcare member, you sometimes work with physicians who train somewhere where they didn't have a pharmacist on their team. And when they see you're board certified, that means a lot to them and it adds credibility to what you're recommending when you're making recommendations on a team basis.